Hello, this is Presh Talwalkar. In this video, I'm going to show you how the PhotoMath smartphone app can solve many math problems. We're going to take a look at sample questions from the New York State Test 8th grade Common Core Math exam. These are questions they released in August of 2014, which are sample questions of what you'd see in a Common Core exam. Question one, which number is equivalent to three raised to the power of four divided by three raised to the power of two? We're going to solve this problem using the PhotoMath smartphone app. On our phone, we've loaded it. And now what we do is we simply hover over the expression and it tells us the answer instantly, which is nine. This is pretty cool. Let's do another example of a question. Determine the product 800.5 times 2 times 10 to the power of 6. We'll once again get out the smartphone PhotoMath app. Now the expression is a little bit narrow, so we can swipe to change the window we now put the window over the expression and it instantly tells us the answer is 1.061 times 10 to the power of 9. So our answer is D. This is pretty cool, but you could probably solve those problems on a regular calculator. Let's take a look at another problem. What is the solution to the system of equations below? 3x plus 4y equals minus 2, 2x minus 4y equals minus 8. We'll swipe to get the window to be about the right size of the rectangle for the equations. We'll hover over the system of equations and instantly it will tell us the answer is y equals 1 and x equals minus 2. And we know the answer is D. Let's try one more problem. Solve the equation below. 0.4 times the quantity 2x plus 1 half equals 3 times the quantity 0.2x plus minus 2 minus 4. Not only do we have to solve it, but we have to show our work. We'll get out the window on the smartphone PhotoMath app. We'll hover over the expression and it tells us the answer is equal to minus 51. But we need to show our work. No worries. We click on the answer and PhotoMath gives you the step-by-step -step derivation for how you get x equals negative 51. So although the smartphone photo app will solve many problems, I wanted to give an example of here's a problem it could not solve. In fact, the app could only solve about 5 out of 32 questions. So there's still many problems it could not solve, and you still need to learn math. But this app will help you. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. You can get my books listed on my website. Catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions. Catch Mind Your Decisions on Facebook and Google+. You can also catch me at Presh Talwalker on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. And you can support me on Patreon.